First of all, in this video, we will see how to create a board outline in a PCB. Like, uh, once you have the schematic ready, which is what we have here, we would like to import the schematic netlist into a PCB and start our routing, right? So for this, um, we should have a PCB file. So when you create a project in KiCad, automatically there will be a PCB uh, uh, file created as well so when you double click on this okay you can see that uh, a pcb page um, with the uh, sheet will get opened up so there won't be anything here and for this uh, uh, we have to actually start working on um, creating the board outline and then importing all the components and placing them in the within the outline so the the board outline is nothing but the actual dimensions of the PCB. Like example, in our case, we wanted to have a 25 by 50 mm PCB. So here, what we are going to do is we have to first start with actually setting up the grid. So um, if we go here, sorry, um, view, okay, uh, grid properties, you can see that uh, there is a um, grid that is set here. So grid is nothing but actually uh, the minimum size that you want to move your cursor. Okay, so you wanted to have it as low as possible uh, because in schematic you can have it high, but in PCB you want to root right. So you, you would like to have as low as possible. So for this we have um, user defined grid now for 0.001 mm. And then um, in in the <coughs> fast switching option, select the user grid um, where uh, you can actually switch between different uh, uh, grid options. For now we kept the same. Okay. Now let us see how to start uh, drawing the board outline. That will be the first thing. Okay. Here um, before drawing the board outline, um, we have to go to this drop down. Okay, and then you see here we have something called edge cuts. So edge cuts are nothing but uh, the, the uh, border outline. Okay, and then the edge cut is actually uh, just a line. Okay, so now click on uh, uh, the rectangle here. And select a particular place for now and draw a line. Okay, you can also see uh, approximately we can draw um, uh, 50 mm easily. Okay, so uh, double click uh, to exit, escape, and now uh, double click on the line, you see the properties. Okay, so let us assume um, we are going to <coughs> start at 80, okay, or we are going to start at 90 and end at 90 because it's a vertical line and uh, let us assume we are also going to start at 90 so the, the height we wanted for the board the length um, uh, we wanted for the board is 50 mm okay and you can see it is 50 mm so just in case if you want to uh, uh, check uh, whether <coughs> this uh, uh, length 50 mm or not you can see here oh this is 10 20 30 40 mm okay now it is only 40 mm right we have to put 100 mm sorry okay now you can see here the board uh, with this 50 mm. in case if you want to drag this click on it you can drag wherever you want and uh, also if you want the exact uh, dimensions without any decimal points on the grid okay uh, you can actually have that as well so 87 means let us take uh, 90 90 to 50 is 140 okay so this is how we just put now uh, you can see here and then start uh, drawing the next line so here we wanted that uh, 25 mm right uh, um, okay let us 
put it there and then if you start here you can see it actually started with 100 and then we wanted 125 and uh, y is always 90 because that's where we started okay you can see both these lines get joined now uh, we can actually copy this okay and place it here uh, and you can see again uh, we have to adjust a little because the resolution is much very very less right uh, and then this is 90 this is 140 okay. now again copy this okay, now if you double click here you can see this is 100 this is 125 and it will be y will be 140 Okay, now our board outline is ready and as we said if you want to move it anywhere you can select everything and move it okay and in case if you want to change your grid if you are not comfortable with the grid right click and select the grid and you can select whatever you want okay now in case if you want your line width to be much thicker okay uh, you can have point 0.2 point 0.2 you can change uh, as per your requirement some people might want to have a thicker uh, um, outline okay so this is the board outline right so our board outline which is actually 25 by 50 which we visualized is ready now when you go to the measure tool you can see this is 25 and when you measure here this is 50 which is what we require so the board outline is ready um, and only thing you have to ensure is here you have to select the edge cuts such that uh, uh, you actually uh, doesn't uh, um, root actually a copper and it's just a board outline and um, at the bottom of the page you can also see the grid uh, which is not visible in this video but uh, uh, here underneath the <coughs> cursor where we are pointing out so we will see the grid options as well listed out so this is how we just start with drawing a board outline and this board outline will be uh, used um, to define the board size and this will be the very first starting point uh, for the PCB um, routing and once board, board outline is uh, um, defined we will start importing the components onto the PCB.